I tell him, I'm taking your pouch. Or your pouch and your life. What did he say? He said, there's a third option. Get his hand inched towards his knife. What then? He got a bolt in the back. Too bad he turned out to be poor. The poor ones are always uppity. Welcome back to The Witcher 2. I believe this is part 6. <clears throat> we get to go to the prison barge. Oh, I guess it's this guy over here. Hey, guards. What do you want? To speak with the wounded prisoner. No one's allowed. I'm here on Commandant Laredo's orders. I already cut a deal with you, but... So get out of my way. He won't tell you much. He's dying. Something's better than nothing. We're supposed to be following Triss. Why don't you... There you go, Triss. Shut your traps. Stop bloody moaning down there. Look, Coffer's dozed off. Wakey, wakey, Coffer. You'll fall asleep forever any day now. <laughs> Prison ships. They beat him bad. Not a great part He's of history. He's got at least a dozen fractures. I'll need your help. What do I do? The spell I'm going to use is painful. It could kill him if he thrashes around. I'll use the Axie sign to calm him. Perfect. Oh. Thought I'd have time to Look, pour wine. Birdie's all wet. Hey, Birdie! Looking at me. Get ready, Birdie! We'll be there to see you right after our watch. Oh. I'm supposed to interact with it. It's no use. You wish, Horson. I'm no traitor. He's raving. That gun? Where am I? In Flotsam. On the prison barge. The convict's barge? I'm done for. We need to find Orvith. How did they catch you? We're fighting Lorito like you. I mean, I don't think we're fighting Lorito yet. I'd like to. I don't like Lorito. How did Lorito's goons catch Yorvith's right hand elf? I was betrayed. How else? By whom? There's a witcher among the Squiatel, or we saved your life. You'd be dying in pain if it wasn't for us. If it wasn't for the Dwarn, I wouldn't be here. There's a Witcher in Yorvith's unit. Like every Dwarn, he turned out to be a bastard. What happened? Mm. He betrayed us. He said he had an offer for me. So we met, where Roses of Remembrance grow. I should have known. Roses of Remembrance? Yes. Some of the last in the world. He thought that I'd betray my elven brother in order to control the unit. I refused. And there was a fight. I've never seen anything like it. No human can move that fast. It was a massacre. I was the first to be hit. Thus I survived. I would have bled to death had Laredo's men not found me. Letho will kill Yorveth, and all will be lost. So many dead, so much suffering. All for naught. This Letho is full test killer? Letho. He's the Kingslayer? Yes. Why does this Dwan want Yorveth dead? Why does the Dwan want Yorveth dead? He used us. Right. From the I don't start. need to read it. Our hatred. But he no longer needs Yorveth. Sees him as a thorn in his side. Mm. But I don't know what Letho wants. What sort of a sh the the f mm. What is Yorveth planning? What does Yorveth want? Why flotsam? Go plow yourself. You first. If I kill you, no one will help Yorveth. Or only I can warn Yorveth. Or tell me, I'm on your side. You have to tell me, I'm on your side. If you say so. 
Flotsam is only the beginning. We're no bandits, we fight for freedom. In due time, Yorvith will answer the call, and we'll emerge from the woods, joining the battle. What battle? He wasn't specific. In that case, I'll ask Yorvith himself. <laughs> I'd like to see that. We were enough. We got what we came for. What now? Yorvith. What if Yorvith already knows? I've got an old saying all ready for him. My enemy's enemy is my friend. Warn him, Gwynplaid. Yorvith fights, for that is what he does best. He's Enshe, a real one, a free one. Among the last, fighting makes sense. Now more than ever before, there is still hope. What are you talking about, Kieran? Hope for what? For change. For a better tomorrow. I'll not see it. They'll torment me to death on this barge, and I'll go gladly where the apple trees bloom. But you must warn Yorveth. Hmm. Yennefer told me that Ciri has departed. Oh today. no! She inhabits another world and is happy there. Before she left this one, she gave us the Isle of Avaloch, our island. We stopped counting time. People believe that the wraiths of the Wild Hunt are immortal. They race across the heavens, gripping in their bony hands swords, their lightning bolts. They take away mortals, never expanding their cavalcade of spectral riders. They burned the orchard and the house. In their armored boots, they trampled our island. Got me a little bit dizzy there. Geralt, are you all right? I've been to the Isle of Avalach, among the apple trees and the mists. After the massacre in Rivia, Suri took me there, and Yennefer. The Wraith Riders kidnapped Yen, and I pursued them. But... Triss, this is important. I feel like everything's coming together. When the Witchers found me barely alive a half year ago near Kaer Morhen, I was fleeing the Wraiths of the Hunt. They continued to pursue me in the outskirts, then in Vizima when I killed the Grand Master. Now I know it was no coincidence. Kieran mentioned roses of remembrance growing somewhere near here. Cedric claims likewise. If that's true... Right now I should be searching the forest for Yorvith, not looking for flowers. I could restore your memory. You sure? Everything seems to indicate that. Whatever's blocking your memory is clearly weakening. I think I could break that barrier with just one petal from a Rose of Remembrance. Those flowers are truly powerful. Oh, hence case, why they're called Rose of Remembrance. Want Convenient. me to go with you? <laughs> It'd be nice if you did, or I need to do this on my own. But if she comes with us, we're probably going to have to... <sighs> I'd love your company. All right, then. Let's go. Cedric mentioned there are some old elven buildings near the Cascade in the forest. We should start there. Lead the way. I'm Shut not a huge traps. Stop bloody moaning Shut down up. there. Look, not not a huge off. fan of. Um, wakey, wakey, coffer. You'll... Let's get away from these noisy guards. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of <clears throat> traveling with NPCs because you know they tend to get killed. Let's go, Triss! Jeez. Freaking pathing issues. And now... There we go. Oh, crap! Where's my weapons? Wonder how many more... Oh, crap! Wait, 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 wait! I can't get the. Oh crap! I have no weapons! Alright, there we go. 
I'll be back, Triss. I need to figure out what happened to my weapons. Are they still in the barge? I'm not wearing armor either. What the heck? Wacky wacky uh, coffer. Okay, You're where asleep, are they at? Laredo's place, maybe? When did we lose the armor and the weapons? Like, I don't have any swords at all. So, parading among his There we are. Glad we made the deal. True enough. Some Jeez. Ooh. That's way better than Diablo. Oh, the Diable has um, a few magical enchantments that are real nice there. I think I'll actually hold on to that. All right. All right, we got our weapons, finally. Let me go figure out what the heck that was all about. Oh! Oh, can I, like, not kill him? There we go. Come on, Triss. Dead guy. Stupid traps. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Let's try to disarm it. Ah, <clears throat> oh, this looks familiar. <clears throat> what are you doing? Oh. the same you know what now we gave you a chance pursued us anyway oh, I think we've arrived the cascade the menier we need to take the path leading upwards gardens in the middle of forests those elves really like to complicate things Stop whining. It's not far now. <laughs> you glare! Every time! Why is it never Triss who steps on a trap? Cedric told me a beautiful legend about this place. Legends are almost always beautiful, especially elven ones. True. The reality often leaves a lot to be desired. Well, Cedric also point. said the site itself was something wonderful. The rose must be here somewhere. I'll look around. Alden and Cymeril. Cedric said Cymeril eclipsed even Francesca Findebear with her beauty, and Francesca's reputed to be the world's most beautiful woman. Cedric drinks too much. <laughs> he really has visions, you know. He really has the gift. He could learn to control it if he drank less. Cedric drinks to get rid of the visions, and that's something I understand perfectly well. Oh my. Lovers. Look, girl. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. huh. I just don't understand it. Rose of Remembrance. Triss. Simon's oh, we Rose of Remembrance. Missed some dialogue there. Legend has it they wilt unless nourished with blood, and also if they're sold. But give it to someone you love, and it'll live forever. Uh... I mean, it's really not fair. Well, this is good. <laughs> oh, please, Geralt. It's just some stupid elven story. 
Give me the rose before you break it. It's not stupid, it's just that... This is the statue, Curly. Ah, jeez. Don't mind us. Imagine the corn we'll get. I won't leave the brothel for a month. Six weeks, even. Where does that woman get the yeah. gold for all this? I mean, her and the old man, they're buying a new house. And now these statues for the garden. Must be defrauding the treasury. What's a town chancellor do anyway? It'd be plowing hard to move. We'd never shift it in one piece. I know. We'll break off the legs, the heads, remove it in bits. Break off your own head, clown. Shut your trap, cunt. Watch your mouth, boy. And... Kill them! Not sure what happened to my to the visuals there. Like the oranges look real washed out. Is it just because it's night? Like out, Tris. Watch out! Take care of that guy. Wow. Roses extend underground. Cool. Incredible what the end shape built before human ships ever appeared in the Pontar Delta. Wow. Humans possess a sensitivity humans can't ever hope it's to. It's kind acquire. of a bathhouse. It's quite pretty. We're trapped. That is pretty, isn't it? Mandrake root! In the chest. Ah, book on the wild hunt. Excellent. According to the Nordlings, the wild hunt is a procession, or rather, a clavicade of skeletal horsemen. They rush across the sky on the bony remains of steeds clad in the rusty remnants of armor. They wear jagged swords at their waists. Like comets, the wild hunt is an omen of war, which has been confirmed beyond all doubt. The Spectral Clavocade Cavalcade, Cavalcade I can never pronounce that right. The Spectral Cavalcade ventures out in search of victims every several years, but its harvest was never as rich as just before the last war with Nilfgaard, when over 20 souls went missing in Novigrad alone after the hunt passed through. Curiously, elven and dwarven legends make not the slightest mention of the Wild Hunt. Curiously. <clears throat> Sup, Tris? Looks like we're stuck. Mm -hmm. Well, there must be another way out of here. Mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me that way? Do I have something on my face? Uh -uh. What's going on in that head of yours, Witcher? Ah, <laughs> uh, do we choose it? Should we choose it? I've already got to edit this video, so... Oh, you know. Stuff. You could use a bath. So could you. That was, um... Awkward. <laughs> awkward foreplay. I guess the no nudity mod doesn't work on that either.
A witcher's blade. Letho comes here to think. Well, he's not here now, so we've no reason to stay. The Dwan stole the story of Elden and Cymeril, but they now steal our roses of remembrance. A more silly and shallow tale I've never heard. An enchanted wood, a beautiful elven couple living within. A handsome human prince arrives, riding a milk-white stallion. Bloody Dwan. We Enshay remember how it was. Limitless devotion, passion, commitment, and sacrifice. Legend has it the lovers' sighs are enchanted within these very stones, though only those in love can hear them. Interesting. <laughs> Singing bushes, jabbering stones, elven hogwash. <laughs> Dwarf is not amused. Well, I'm buggered. Ah, oh, that was worthwhile just for the walks more often. <laughs> for a while there I forgot all about Flotsam, the Scoyatel, the King's Lair, the whole world really. Nice to know I still have that power. I need time to devise the spell. It could take as much as a few days. Mm hmm What do you plan to do while you wait? I'm going to meet Yorvith. Well don't get yourself killed. That'd be pretty stupid now. What are you getting at? You're about to recover your memory, which will give you a whole new perspective on things. We'll learn what happened to Yennefer. Uh-huh. And you expect me to drop everything and tell Roach, Hey, it's been great, but I've got places to go and people to find? You know, you could. I, I mean, you don't really owe him anything. I'm just afraid you'll get caught up in something and you won't be able to back out. I mean, we're already kind of caught up in something. He's a sly old elf. He's been fighting humans for a full century at least. This Letho is no common bandit either, and I shudder to think who put him on the warpath. It's a mire, Geralt, deep and hungry, and it could swallow you whole before you know it. It possibly already has. Yeah. I want you to know that I'm prepared to travel to the end of the world with you to save Yennefer. I owe you that. I owe her that. I'm prepared to drop everything. The trappings of court life, politics, the regicides. I could even live at Kaer Morn. It's up to you. Tris. Let me finish. I can only say this once. If you want to go alone, I'll understand. And I won't try to persuade you otherwise. We'll catch the Kingslayer before you finish your preparations, or I don't want to lose you. I can't know what the future holds. I don't know what else is hidden in my mind. But whatever it is, whatever happens, I don't want to lose you. I'd have to be an utter fool and complete ingrate to let you go. That's... kind. Thank you. Does that mean we're leaving the regicides to Roach and tending to our own matters? Uh, I can't. I really would like to go, but I need to clear my name. Foltest's men and bounty hunters of all kinds would never let it go. We'd be fugitives, and that's not a life I'd want for me or for you. Besides... I'd feel as if I'd given up when there was still something to do. I'd feel like I fled. And as I see it, we haven't lost yet. Whatever your decision, I want you to know you can count on me. 
I need a few days to prepare the spells. I need to talk to Zoltan about Yorvith. It's not a closed conversation. We'll talk again, but only after I've settled things with the Kingslayer. Oh. Interesting sequence of events there. I wonder what would happen if we hadn't <clears throat> made Whoopi. That whole bit with the dwarf <laughs> hearing us. <laughs> there you are. Is everything all right? Why, well, your this timing is, nice. is impeccable. What a beautiful place. Very. How do you find us? Finding those I seek is a speciality of mine. Now, let's get out of here. The Scoyatel are out in droves. Okay. Let's get out of here then. Whoop, oh, sorry, Roach. What's going on, Geralt? What's going on with you? Uh, Lorita's up to something big. Lorita wants the Scoyatel gone for good. He didn't say anything specific, but in his mind's eye, he saw them on the prison barge already. Yorvath's outsmarted bigger fish than the Commandant. Lorito's mm. got something going with Sheila, so I'd take him seriously if I were you. You never know. Maybe the sorceress hunts more than monsters. What does that mean? Flotsam's in the wilderness. It's a good hideout. A little town deep in the forest, terrorized by Scoyatel. You should be in your element, Roach. Flotsam isn't just any old town, Geralt. Temeria, Redania, Kedwin, and Edern. The largest kingdoms in the north. Know what they all have in common? The Pontar Valley. A strip of land they've been battling over for generations. Exactly. And here's Flotsam, on the border between Temeria and Edern, with Kedwin lying in wait just the other side of the marshes. At the very edge of the Pontar Valley. Stuck in the middle like a candle up the arse. The north's most important trade routes meet here. Every caravan has to come through Flotsam, and anyone who wants to place their cargo on a boat on this section of the river has to bear Lorito in mind. They say Henselt of Kedwin has gathered an army and is heading for Vergen. The Pontar Valley will be on fire soon, while we, Geralt, are sitting in Flotsam, the gateway to the valley. I'd like to believe it's pure coincidence and the killer just followed the squirrels here. Naive to say the least, Witcher. We're wasting time here. You'll get a chance to show your mettle. If we're to capture Foltest's murderer, we'll have to clash with the Scoyatel. I sent the boys out into the woods. Tough going, too dense. My scouts got ambushed and barely escaped. It's no picnic hunting elves in the forest. Tell me something I don't know. My people saw the Kingslayer again. He knows we're here, but he's not even trying to escape. Seems he's waiting for something. I think it's our move. See you later. So long, Roach. As he shoves him out of the way. Ooh. Bryonia. Ooh, rain increases the damage dealt by spells that produce electrical charges. Quentin's signs becomes even more deadly, however, didn't read the rest of that. I don't see the hole we fell through. Uh, yeah, I wonder what, how that uh, cutscene would have played out had we not chosen the dirty, dirty route. <laughs> I, I'm probably not going to take the time to edit all of the, the nakedness in that, in that scene. I'm probably just going to blur it all, the entire screen out, just because it's, that's going to be, that's going to be a lot, that's going to be time consuming. All right, let's get back to town and talk to Zoltan about the Scoyatel. Still got the bodies hanging there. There is no way that they would... There's no way they'd be in good shape. How many days, weeks has it been now? Day and night cycles? Dandelions are snoozing. No, I can't stand this place any longer. Oh, <laughs> well, I guess we just woke him up. Hey, Zoltan. Uh, heard anything interesting recently? Any news? Triss has sniffed something out. Apparently, there are prisoners on the barge in the port. 
Yeah, we got that. No less. I need to find Yorveth. Zoltan, I need to ask you a favor. Shoot. I heard you know the local Squaretel. You heard? Meaning some goods arse and a helmet hollowed it out in the market square. I need some way to get to this Yorveth. You know, I don't want you thinking I'm all chummy with the Squaretel. And Yorveth detests me. Why would you want to see him anyway? He knows where the Kingslayer is. Yorveth? And here I always thought I'm a common thug. All right. No reason to sit on our arses. Come on. You can tell me everything on the way. All right. Guess we get to follow Zoltan now. Lead on, Zoltan. Tell me, who said I have contacts with the Scoyotel? Marino. What a prick. That's why he wanted to hang you? For making deals with the squirrels? What? I met a few, yes, but made no fucking deals. What about their leader? They say your are very smart, but the Scoyotel are at his beck and call. Sword knows what he wants. Hope he'll tell me what it is. Tell you what, of two Shall evils, Lorido's the bigger prick. Because he almost hanged you? Because he stirs up the locals against non-humans. And there's what he's colluding with Kedwin. What's his angle? Greed! King Hansel would gladly annex more land and grant Lorido privileges. Come on, we've got a long way to go. Yes, so I suggest you move. Oh, jeez, the pathing in this. Oi. We need to go deeper into the forest. I hope they didn't change the password. You know their password? What are you playing at, Sultan? All right. The Scoyatel asked me to command a unit. Guess they'll never learn. I died! For Pete's sake! Slowest death screen ever. Oh, we're crying out loud. Tell me, who said I have caught Let's go, Zoltan! Lorino. At his beck and call. Sword knows what he wants. Geralt, you coming? Get back oh my here. god! Hope you'll tell me what it is. Tell you what, of two evils, Lorido is the beggar. Alright, let's try not to die this time. Slam that door. Now let's go, Zoltan. Let's go! We need to go deeper into the forest. I hope they didn't change the path. And dragons are terrifying, man. It's just like giant arachnid bug things. Let's go! This is it. I was due to meet them here. Ah. I know. This is the spot, Dying I guess. Arrows at us. What? Geralt, I know full well you're always vigilant, but quit poking fun at me. 
Give them the password. What them? Hurry up, they're edgy. Kierkegaard! Stop bawling. What do you want? Countersign. Heidegger. I asked you a question. Take us to Jorvith. Why? If we wanted to speak with you, we wouldn't ask for your leader. Jorvith won't talk with you. You don't know that. Leave while you're still able. The two of you won't scare us off. There are four more in that tree. How do you know? I can hear them <laughs> His eyes just went... One's sick, we're on fist tech. How? He's <laughs> wheezing. What? You elven cocks gone soft? Ooh. We just want to talk to you. Dwarf burn! Wait at the clearing. The dwarf knows where. We'll let Jorvith know. Make sure you do. Come on, Geralt. I know what those elven pricks have planned. Been there once. It's a dog's life, Geralt. I'll tell you that much. Okay. Can you show me where... Okay, there we go. Jeez, man. Come on, Zoltan. We're here. That creature prowls down there. Right where we're supposed to meet Jorvith. Exactly. Any ideas? I last fought an Ericus some time ago. Oh, I never had Ericus. the swiping pleasure. Not that I mind. Wait here. What are you? A giant spider Think creature from the prick? from the cutscene. That's a dog's life, Geralt. I'll tell you that. Yes, way. yes, I gathered. This is the place the elves mentioned. That thing approaching us is no elf. I'll leave it to you, Geralt. Monsters are not my special. Oh boy! Wonder how many more will turn up. Oh, and my health is not great. Oh, I'm gonna die! Crap! Son of a gun. This is the place the elves mentioned. That thing approaching us is no elf. Over to you, girl. Monsters are not my speciality. Oh, wait. I have Erdin. I could use Erdin. Oh! Get away, Zoltan! For frickin'... Why am I stuck? Come on! Oh, for... Come on! Chase me! What does it take to get this thing to chase me? Whoa! What happened there? And I'm dead. Freaking hell, man. Ugh. I don't even know what's going on. I'm just trying not to die. I'll leave it to you, Geralt. Monsters are not my There we go. Just roll back, man! Frick, man. Like he says, I'll leave it to me. And then he just... <laughs> Sucker. Trying to roll back without getting hit. And yeah, that doesn't go well. At least you're serving as a distraction there, Zoltan. Come on! He just stands there! 
Tough. It's like a giant hermit hermit crab spider thing. I wanted to loot. And a lovely show, Gwynblade. But tell me, was it worth it? An uneven fight and certain death await you anyway. I could ask you the same thing. What do you want, that gun? Speak quickly before I kill you both. I'll take you with me. You're a murderer. I mean, yeah, it is, but that's not going to get us anywhere. Letha wants you dead. Let Zoltan go. Letho betrayed you. He wanted to make a deal with your comrade, Kirin. Kirin Ep Esnilin is dead. Two weeks ago, his warriors were ambushed and killed. You should invent better lies, Gwynblade. He's on the barge, wounded but alive. He turned Letho down, and his unit paid the ultimate price. If you speak the truth, Letho will die. But words alone are not enough. All right, now we're getting somewhere. There are non-humans living in Flotsam. You attack and murder the people of Flotsam, forgetting that elves and dwarves live among them. That's no life. They've been stripped of self-respect, forced to live and die by human Who laws. the hell are you? They're more Dwan than you, Geralt. He doesn't want freedom for the elves. He wants, he wants to rule them. That's what I'm gathering there. What's your connection to the Kingslayer? So the hired assassin turned out to be a traitor. <laughs> it's his word against yours. For now, why do you trust him? Because he's a Dwan who agreed to do shady work for you? He did what had to be done. He proved nobody's untouchable. What are you really fighting for? Hmm? What's your angle, Yorvith? You wouldn't understand. Oh, I Hiding wouldn't. In woods, killing berry pickers, eating roots. We live by our own rules, doing what's necessary to attain our goal. How's that going for you? What is your goal? What's it to you, Geralt? Eseth Vatgen? You tell me to stuff it up my ass. Not everything deserves Possibly. that fate. My life now depends on your whim, so I'm curious. Then listen well. The two dead kings were Horsons who damned their own children to stay in power. But in the East, there's someone truly deserving of a crown. What are you gonna do with Leather? You still trust this assassin? You may be lying. If I'm lying, so did Kieran. We'll investigate it for his sake. We shall see how Leather reacts to your sensational news. Where is he? He's here, isn't he? The ruins of Kelmawed. For some reason, he likes the place. My unit will cover us. Ready? I suppose. Why did you want Foltes dead? He might have appeared charming, but in reality, he allowed the elder races in Temeria to be oppressed. He was like Old Dwan, but his death has more significance. All right, then it's time to go. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this video here, and I'm going to pick it up in part seven. I'll see you in a few minutes.